This is for Scorpio, so I'm rising and Venus signs. This is for Scorpio. My name is D Reader, the Mean All Tarot. Once again, for those of y'all that are new and welcome to the Mean All Channel, y'all. Let's see what's coming in for Scorpio right now. So we got the Garden and the Gate. Somebody can be 30, and we got Broken Heart. Somebody can have a nine year old. And then we also have Journey in Reverse. So some of y'all are very heartbroken about how the situation went right now. So a lot of my Scorpios are like in a disappointed energy. Let's say that. What else is coming in for Scorpio right now? So we do got the yin and the yang. Somebody can be 22. And we also have the temple path. Somebody can have a 12-year-old. And we got storm warnings in reverse. So yeah, a lot of you are going through some type of storm period in your life. And then we also got the six chakra. So for a lot of my Scorpios, this is using your third eye. It's going to be extremely important as well. And so we got anxiety in reverse. Somebody can have an 18-year-old. And somebody can have a 16-year-old. We got patience in reverse. And then we also got happy family in reverse. Somebody got a four-year-old. And we got the fifth chakra facing forward. Somebody can be 39. And somebody can be 38. We got the fourth chakra in reverse. And we got the woman holding the heart in reverse. So somebody could be 44 as well. And then we got the woman holding the coin facing forward. Somebody could be 42. So for a lot of my Scorpios, I am getting, especially for my Scorpio women, there is some type of financial abundance or financial prosperity coming in for you right now. You just got to trust the process, even if you don't see it at this time. And so we got walking away, facing forward. Somebody can be 27 and we got victory in reverse. So a lot of y'all are manifesting you know, winning and just getting through a situation, which I do see happening for you. And somebody got 11 year old and somebody can also be 25. We got deceit facing forward. So, yes, some of y'all are dealing with a deceitful energy. Some of y'all are dealing with someone who is deceitful. So just keep that in mind as well. We got all tied up in reverse. Somebody can be 32 and we got indecision in reverse. Somebody can have an eight year old. So a lot of y'all are feeling stuck in a situation and some of y'all didn't make the correct decision when it came to a situation at the bottom of the deck. We got blossom and abundance in reverse. So some of you stopped your own abundance flow. Nobody got in the way of your abundance, but you, for a lot of my Scorpio. So just keep that in mind, too. So we got the angel of fertility and the guardian angel that just came out of my hand. Somebody could be 28, maybe 20. You could be manifesting pregnancy. Congratulations. And somebody could have a nine-year-old. So I do see that a lot of y'all have your own spiritual gifts or your own spiritual power. So we got the angel of nature in reverse, the angel of knowledge in reverse, and the angel of strength in reverse. So a lot of y'all at this moment are feeling very stressed out, I'm getting, but I do see a guardian angel coming through to protect you. A lot of y'all are wanting clarity or knowledge or the truth when it comes to a situation, but this is the universe telling you, know, like, hey, it's just going to take some time. So... We got the angel of harmony in reverse. Somebody could be 24. And we got the parking angel. Somebody could have a nine-year-old. And somebody could be, somebody could have an 18-year-old. We got the career angel in reverse. So for a lot of y'all, this could also be a new beginning or a new start coming in for you. What else is coming in right now? Let's see what else is coming in. So somebody could have a two-year-old. We got the bullying prevention angel and we got the guardian angel facing forward so some of y'all were going through a situation to where you felt like you were being pressed or pushed to do something that you really didn't want to do or that you just felt like wasn't right or that you just felt like wasn't for you at the bottom of the deck we got the angel of patience in reverse so some of y'all are being impatient but they're pretty much letting you know like if you remain patient, if you trust in God, and if you trust in the process, then something will happen for you, especially something that you've been manifesting or waiting for for a while. This will finally take off for you. And then we got a holiday. So we got the answer so that you've been looking for can be found during the vacation, retreat, or holiday getaway. And then we also got birthday. So I do see for a lot of y'all right now at this moment that your birthday was pretty good. A lot of y'all had a great birthday. Some of y'all, you learned something new about yourself. And then for some of you, you experienced an experience that you didn't expect. And we also got business ventures. So we got trust and follow through on new business ideas or career paths. And we also got practice, practice, practice. So for those of you that are wanting to start a business or start a brand, 
then, you know, with daily practice, you will be able to reach the goals that you're trying to reach, right? And then we also got your wishes granted. So we got what you asked for is becoming true. And we got pregnancy. Congratulations. We do got a Scorpio that is pregnant. We got a Scorpio that's also been manifesting pregnancy. So this is really good for you. And then we also have do some research. So we have, you need more information on your situation. Look further before proceeding. And we also have dietary change. So we got improve your diet and your life will also improve. And then we have perfect timing and ask for what you want. So we have, this is the right time for you to move forward and let the universe and other people know what you need. So that's going to be extremely important for you as well. And then we also have goodbye to the old and hello to the new. You have finished one part of your life and a new and even better part is beginning. And we also have your desires are within reach. So everything that you've been asking the universe for Scorpio is finally coming your way. Everything that you've been praying for is about to happen for you. Everything that you've been asking for is in route of you. But you got to believe that. Let's see what else is coming in for Scorpio right now. So we do got childish. Someone has to be the adult in the room. And we also have public image. It looks like all somebody cares about is their public image. It's like you care about Instagram, taking pictures. But what about your man? What about your girl? What about them? You're so worried about Instagram and looking good and taking pictures that you're forgetting about the person that has your back. You're forgetting about the person that, you know, is going to ride for you. So that's the big thing for a lot of y'all right now. And then we also got empty. So we got the truth is that you simply don't feel fulfilled and it's worth is wait. It's worth the wait to find true happiness. And then we also have brief affairs. So we got brace for sudden ending, short but sweet, can't last. And we also have gold digger. So we got I'm in for what in for for what they can get, money hungry, self-starving, and we also have negativity. So we got like a dark cloud above. You are depressed in extreme mood. Somebody's really negative. And we also got bottled up. It looks like there's a bottle up of emotions that is causing someone to be negative. And then we also have it takes two. So we got someone is not committed and capable of, you know, love or just showing love or just being that loving energy. I'm getting that's really important for a lot of y'all as well. Let's see what else is coming in for Scorpio right now. I appreciate y'all and thank y'all so much. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe and also comment. So we do got the Joker. It's all a game to them. Insecure, just having fun. And we also have facing it. So we have, you know, something isn't right. Don't be afraid to find out the truth. It will set you free. And we also have a drift. So we have not willing to settle down or be responsible time to commit or put down roots. And we also have sneaky snake. So we got going behind your back, deceitful and swindler. So this person is a user, a manipulator, a liar. This could be a masculine energy for a lot of my Scorpio, especially for those of y'all that are dealing with a masculine energy you know take what energy resonates of course and leave what doesn't so we have you're very close to achieving your goals and we also have some scorpio energy so you're coming in your own energy it's time to release negativity so we keep seeing a lot of signs of negativity so i don't know if this is you being negative or the person that you're dealing with but this is the universe basically that you know like hey if you're wanting something different right now then you have to you know release this energy let's see what else is coming in we got more Scorpio energy. So you're coming in your own energy a lot right now. We got work through your fears and your commitment is being tested. So if you're dealing with another Scorpio, this is definitely for you. But other than that, a lot of y'all, your commitment is being tested right now. The universe is trying to see how strong you are. The universe is trying to see how serious you are as well. And we also have take time to breathe out. And we got some cancer energy. So if you're dealing with a cancer, maybe you need a break from this cancer. This cancer could need a break from you. So... Just kind of keep that in mind as well. Let's see what else is coming in. And then we also have have faith in your dreams. And we got some Aquarius energy. Show the world the real you. So this is putting out good energy. This is putting out good vibes. And this is showing a different version of you, even if it's hard. And we also have emotions are running high. And we got some Sagittarius energy. Look at the bigger picture. So this is looking at your situation from a better perspective, from a better standpoint. And we also have the answers you need are coming and a good time for healing.
So if you're dealing with a Gemini, you could be trying to heal from a Gemini or a Gemini could be trying to heal from you as well. This Gemini has like a two-faced energy that could be what separated y'all. At the bottom of the deck, we got nothing is yet set in stone. So if you're dealing with one of these signs, I'm not seeing a full commitment just yet. But that doesn't mean that it can't happen. I appreciate every single Scorpio. Thank you.